morning guys, welcome to Merlin's Ears. Harry, where are we going today? Drayton Manor. Yay, we're going to Drayton Manor theme park. It's not somewhere we go very often because it's not included in the Merlin Pass, um, but we're visiting friends up in um, near Birmingham today, so we're gonna head over to Drayton Manor. It's the first time we've been there in probably about four years. Uh, last time we went, um, Thomas Land was a lot smaller, so I understand it's been expanded since, so we're really excited to see what's um, changed in the Thomas Land, and also maybe go on some of the bigger rides because we've got friends with us today so that should be fun and uh, we're just on the road now it's about a 40 minute journey from where we are i'll uh, see you when we get to drayton manor uh, so we've just come in um, through the entrance of drayton manor it's actually surprisingly busy today and um, we had to wait for about 20 minutes to get our tickets because rookie error we forgot to book online so we had to queue up and buy our tickets on the day i'll put the price information in here for you so it does look quite busy here today. I'm not sure what the queue times are going to be like, but we're just going to go and get Harry's ride access pass. And then hopefully we'll be able to make good use of that while we're here. Um, but the rides look amazing. I can't wait to go on some of these. <laughs> coaster so it kind of you leave the station kind of going up backwards and it drops you forwards does a kind of like a little loop thing then goes back again backwards um it's a family coaster but i do feel a little bit nauseous after that one queue time wasn't too bad i think we only waited about 15 minutes so despite it looking really busy when we got here the ride queue times aren't too bad at the moment next ride is going to be apocalypse you can see it just in front of us there it's like a drop tower it goes up quite quick actually. Let me zoom in on a bit for you. Oh, so they don't drop together, they drop separately. And it does drop pretty quick. Let's give it a go. A second ride done. Just been on Apocalypse, we can kind of see it behind me. Just there. I didn't realise, so it's not just a drop tower, you've got the choice. You can either do it sitting down or standing up. Needless to say, I did it sitting down. The wind, I watched the people loading for the standing up and they have like a saddle that they sit on and then it tips them forward a little bit and their feet are dangling. It is so high and it is so fast, but it's a fantastic ride. Absolutely loved it. Oh, this one, the drunken barrels. It looks like a waltzer on a sort of like on a slant. It looks ugh, definitely not one for me, but let's have a look. Oh, there goes Harry and Neil. Oh, well, that one's a definite no for me. <laughs> oh, no. Next up, the Flying Dutchman. Looks quite fun, actually. and a drink probably not wise because we're now heading towards their standing up roller coaster I'm not sure what it's called I think it's a uh, shockwave I think it's called there's a roller coaster there's a corkscrew I believe there's a loop the loop and you're standing up probably not wise after I've just had a hot dog but <sighs> just come off of shockwave oh my goodness that is the first time i've done a standing up roller coaster 
intense, uncomfortable, but so much fun. I was a bit worried about how to get into the into the train itself because it looked quite complicated. Like basically, you've got like a bicycle saddle, and you've got to kind of climb onto the saddle, adjust it so that your feet are, are flat on the floor, and then you like, pull your restraints down and everything. But it is the most weird feeling when you first do the first drop but fantastic ride i'm so glad i've done it so we've done all of the adult rides around drayton manor so the only thing left to do is thomas lands i love this fat controller water feature look at that how cool is that not so sure about the spiders down the bottom though the first ride for us in Thomas Land is going to be Toby's Tram Express and oh look it spins! Yay! <laughs> Mama's going to be sick! So after watching it I've bottled it so I can do a stand up roller coaster, I can't do Toby's Tram Express. ride montage of Thomas Land. We've just actually taken a ride on Thomas himself from Knapford Station over to Tidmouth Holt I think this station's called. Basically this is the other side of the park now so they've got like a little mini zoo and a play area. So we're going to have a little look around, a look around over here and then we're going to head back over to Thomas Land and maybe do some more rides later. I also just come across this Thomas and Friends exhibition so we're going to have a look and see what's inside. Oh wow it's like a huge giant train track or train set. This train set is ginormous. It goes all the way down the end there where Neil is. So one of the Halloween activities at Drayton Manor is the hay bale trail. So as you're going around the park, you've got to spot all these decorated um, hay bales. This one is my favorite. I've got to admit, we haven't been filling in the sheet, but I had to show you this one because it is pretty cool. So after a quick pit stop and a little play in the play area, Harry's found the dino trail. Where are we going now, Harry? Where? Oh, this one. Oh, yeah. T-Rex. Ooh. What have we got next, Harry? Ceratopsis, like the history of the tops. The Taurosaurus, the Pentacleratops. Onifical Cretaceous top. Well, basically all of these dinosaurs. Ah. Oh, what's this one I'm looking at now, Harry? The Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus. Ah. Big dinosaurs. Dino trail complete. Now let's go and see some animals. Oh, it's Hedwig. 
Do 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 do. Drayton Manor. We had a fantastic time. Uh, sorry we didn't get to film very much but we were there primarily to spend time with our friends and we don't get to visit Drayton Manor very much because it's not a Merlin attraction so we wanted to sort of make the most of our time there. Um, we did get to go on a standing up roller coaster for the first time which was terrifying but brilliant at the same time. Um, we have had a great time there. Um, I have put a, like a ride montage uh, together for you so I hope you enjoy that. Uh, thank you for joining us on this adventure and we'll see you again soon. Bye.